Hello, Internet. I hope you've finished buffering. That sounds painful. As you know, every year, travel and leisure, or travel plus leisure, I'm not sure how that's pronounced, surveys its readers to determine their world's best awards. The only category they don't cover is world's best dad. I know that, because I've won that 20 years in a row. Uh-huh. If I didn't, why would they let me keep this mug? And I'm honored to announce that this year, for the fourth year in a row, the best city in America is none other than my hometown of Charleston, South Carolina. The city's so nice, they only had to name it once. Getting this award is a great honor, although a bit time-consuming. As a Southern gentleman, I feel obligated to write thank-you notes to everyone who voted. They're on their way. But this year, for the first time ever, and I believe I'm correct in saying that, yes, I am, travel and leisure has also named Charleston the best city in the world which I believe also means it's the best city in the galaxy. Take that, Kepler-452b. Good luck being a habitable environment for life without the approval of travel and leisure. Also, good work, travel and leisure. I hope this means more world travelers check out my fine city, but not all at once. I think six billion tourists might be a little much.